Happy fizzy. It is below freezing. Yesterday we had a fuckload of hailstones and a bit of snow and sleet. And um, it's hovering around freezing, but it must be slightly below because there's ice. Ice on the road is predictable. You, you know that you get more chance you get an ice where you've got high verges because it's going to be under shadow than there where it's not high verges and more chance of it here because you've got a crosswind. But it's predictable. I've been on bikes since the 1980s, never had a car license, never had a crash with ice. Biggest danger with ice is um, cattle grids because metal is slippery to start with, water is slippery to start with, and then it fucking freezes and you're on rubber tires. Yes, they've been changing. Yes, it's raining, it's starting to spit again. Both my tires are changing actually. It's still a hassle with living in England. You don't get bikers, you get car drivers. Both these tires, I got, I got the bike in August. Both tires are combined 18 years old. So an average of nine years old each, so I need I have to replace them. But I just can't be asked. Oh yeah, it's pissing down. Ah, oh, it's getting harder. Ah, oh, fucking Welsh sending the rain over. So yeah, um, cattle grids. Really, really nasty. But still, had to ride, had to ride. I hate the fact that the bike's got a tail tidy. Because I bought it off, did have the original setup, people wouldn't give it to me. Because he's a fucking jippo traveller settled cunt called Rob Irish. Yeah, I should have been fucking warned by the name. Basically, I said, I didn't want to bike with a mobiliser because I know they have issues with the um, CDI. Oh, it doesn't have one, swear it doesn't have one. It has one. It's also had an, an um, alarm fitted and then taken out, which is another big no no. Fuck me, that's cold. And I'm still wearing leathers. Yeah. And a t shirt. <laughs> Pussies wearing their winter gear. Um, yeah, and basically, he said with a bike, perfect working order, blah blah blah. Both tyres should have been replaced years ago, and both tyres have punctures that have been repaired. The, the repairs are done quite well, but he should have fucking told me. He's selling somebody a bike that I do 170 with no ABS, no traction control, yeah, it's a 2008, no ABS, then. And this person says to you, you max your bikes when you ride them, and I have maxed her. <laughs> I'm not going to say how fast I was going, and I was one video I've never put it on YouTube. But um, I don't mind posting videos of me doing 155 or 160, but I'm not going to post what I actually fucking did or where I did it. <laughs> um, yeah, bright light, which is really fucking evil, because you've got wet ground, wet in the air, and you're basically blinded. There we are. Hello. Come turtle on.